All right, Shalom. <clears throat> First and foremost, I would like to give our honor, our praises, our glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakak with us. Yahweh is the Heavenly Father, who the Word and the cause God. Yahweh Shai, the only begotten Son, who the Word and the cause Jesus Christ. I would like to say the water or thank you to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, for the Rakak with us. The Rakak with us is the Holy Spirit, which is the driving force behind these lessons. I want to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone and rule well. Peace, blessing, grace, and safety goes out to all that I came around the world, preaching and teaching this word and truth and its sincerity. Shalom on to the whole for that. All right, hey, as that you seen that quick little uh, clip I uh, played just now. All right, I seen uh, uh, via the internet. All right, and it's showing um, uh, Edomites. All right, a school a Edomite school teacher got her students pretending to uh, uh, be chained and shackled like the slaves was. All right, from the tribe of Judah. Benjamin and Levi, all right, uh, like the slaves um, from um, reenacting, okay, the uh, the transatlantic slave trade, basically, all right, and uh, a lot of people are upset at it and mad at it, all right, as they should be because it's making a mockery, all right. There's no nothing that can compare or an example can be made of how harsh that time was, all right. But on the flip side, hey, you got Esau, Edom, little Edomite kids practicing. Uh, uh, being slaves, all right, and that's good because they are going into slavery, man. That's the future for Esau, Edom, man. You so-called white people, all right. If your father's lineage is not from the nation of Israel, all right, you will be a a, a slave in the kingdom of heaven. That goes for all other nations, all right. But I'm getting on Esau, so hey, that's good that they was practicing because that's what's going. That's their future, man. Slavery. That's the uh, future for all heathen nations that are not. Uh, 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 Israelites, all right, slavery. So that's good that they was practicing, cause that's they, that's what's gonna happen to them, all right. So let's back that up with some scriptures. It's Revelation thirteen and ten. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killeth with the sword. Here is the patient and the faith of the saints. All right. So the scriptures telling you, he that leadeth into captivity must go into captivity. All right. They was doing a reenactment of an Atlantic trade slave where Edomites, all right, came and got. Uh, the Israelites from the west coast of shores of Africa, all right? So what? The Israelites went into slavery, so the Edomites going to go into slavery, man. He that lead into captivity shall go into captivity, and that's the future judgment of all nations, but starting with Esau, Edom, man, all right? So that's good. They getting their practice on, man, all right? This Revelation 2 and 25, but that which ye have already hold fast till I come. Yeah, they hold fast that knowledge, wisdom, and understanding or the scripture that faith or Yahweh by Hashem Yahshai, the names Yahweh and Yahweh Shai. All right, hold fast to that. Your faith, your belief. All right. Verse 26. And he that overcometh and keepeth my works until the end, to him will I give power over the nations. All right. So the Israelites are going to have power over the other nations in the kingdom of heaven, man. All right. Verse 27, and he shall rule them with the rod of iron. All right, so we're going to be uh, having them in uh, captivity, man, ruling over the other nations. All right, the elect of Israel will rule over the other nations with a uh, um, with what a rod of iron. All right, it says, as the vessels of a potter shall they be broken to shivers, even as I receive of my father. All right, so the nation of Israel is going to rule over all other nations uh, in the kingdom of heaven, man. All right. Does say the Lord, does say the Bible. All right, Joel 3 and 6. The children also of Judah and the children of Jerusalem have ye sold unto the Grecians that you might remove them far from their border. All right, and that's what happened. Okay, the, uh, the children of Israel was uh, 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 put into slavery, man. All right, via the uh, Hamites, the Edomites, and the uh, what, Ishmaelites, man. Okay, all nations had a part in uh, Israel downfall. Verse 7. Behold, I will raise them out of the place where ye have sold them and will return your recompense on your own head. All right. So, hey, the payback is coming to the nations. All right. And those little Edomites practicing it. Verse eight. And I will sell your sons and your daughters into the hand of the children of Judah, and they shall sell them to the Sabines to take a people far off for the Lord has spoken it. All right. So the same way Israelites were bought and sold like cattle. The same thing is going to happen to these other nations. All right. And this is things that we, uh, this is the patient and the faith of the saints. 
Isaiah 14 and 21, prepare slaughter for his children for the iniquity of their fathers, that they do not rise nor possess the land, nor fill the face of the world with cities. All right, so a hey, slaughter is being prepared for the children of Esau, Edom, man. All right, these Edomites that have been living good for the past 500 years. All right, the descendants of them, all right, is about to go into hardcore slavery. All right, when Yahweh Shah makes his return. All right, and you see them uh, practicing, man. All right, so prepare slaughter for your children, man, because Esau Edom been living uh, good, man. All right, reaping the benefits of uh, slavery till this day. All right, till this day, Esau Edom and all the nations are reaping the benefits of slavery of the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. All right, so I just seen that little clip on the internet. And it made me think of how uh, a, a, all these nations, especially Esau, Edom, going to be uh, uh, in slavery, man. Okay? So, call Halal Yahweh, Shemiah, Shai, Shalom.